Hey, what's up, guys? DJ LaFave here with a neat little trick that we just figured out on this wonderful, 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 wonderful tool called Social Stream, which is free. Now, Social Stream, if you guys, there's tons of, vid tons of videos out here already about Social Stream. Uh, Steve, he, he makes this app, and he also does really great in making it better. So I just kind of really dove into it today for the first time, saw some of its features, and I said, whoa, there's something we could do here, something we could do here, which would allow... allow your chat from any chat to be able to control your stream using touch portal and this uh the social stream ninja um app so basically uh, go to the link in the description to get the to download it install it again tons of videos out there what it ends up doing is it has these these overlays that go out so you can pick them from obs you can show different chat messages and whatnot you, you can show them fired off and, and all those those good things what we have done is I have wrote Steve with this idea of like, can you save it locally to a text file anytime someone chats? Because then we can use the power of Touch Portal to be able to use chat to make things happen inside of OBS. Something that the users of the old Leorum board, now Sammy, or streamer.bot were able to do out of the box with YouTube or with, uh, with Twitch. But now I'm going to show you how we can do it with Mixcloud or even just a, a open chat box from Zoom or from your Discord. People can control your OBS studio or really anything that Touch Portal can control. So what I did first off was I went to events and I created a file changes and contains. Here we go. So when the file changes, when this file that I created, it's a little text file changes, then do these things. So if this file, when it changes, contains the words test, fire off these actions. We're going to use this in the upper right as an example. It's just a color source. We're going to turn the color source off, turn it on, turn it off, turn it on automatically just by writing test inside of the chat. So to do that, we're going to open up our chat window that I just have right now from Mixcloud. If you guys aren't already following me, mixcloud.com slash DJ Lefebvre, and we're going to write the word test and test has come through and of course it's uh we gotta put auto on there we go test refresh that that's what it is refresh it and we're gonna say test there we go and i just had to refresh it but but again here you go typing test in the in the chat and uh you know it worked great right before i went to go record this so we're going to maybe because i'm not actually live that might be it but here we go test and it happens so we're now able to control obs studio from other applications not just youtube not just uh not just twitch from anything that is readable inside of socialstream.ninja it's it's fantastic hope you guys all appreciate this make sure you go and follow steve over on youtube his channel, of course, in the description, because that's what we do here. We want to give love where love is uh, is uh, appreciated. And uh, make sure you guys tune into my channel over here on YouTube for lots of more fun stuff. We keep on diving into these tools, diving into these things, and, and just having so much fun while we're doing it again. All right, DJ LaFave, out!